So look, okay, when you're trying to lose weight, you can live yourself, your life in a reactive mode or in a deliberate mode, okay? So in other words, um, reactive mode might be where circumstances, you're letting exterior circumstances dictate the way that you're going to behave, what you're going to eat, what you're going to do, when you're going to eat, you know, all of that. Then there's where you're in an empowerment way. Okay, deliberate, where you plan it, where you develop yourself. And the way you do that, uh, and a number of ways you do that, but one of them is you have to start reprogramming your mind because you can't take the old mindset of you and the way that you used to eat and the way that you used to view nutrition and stuff and expect to use that same thought process and mindset with just a different kind of food and everything. It's, it just, it's, it's different and it, it's going to fight. So you have to reprogram your mind if you want weight loss to really work easier for you and so you can stick with it longer and everything. A couple ways to do that. Um, some people can just simply, you know, you close your eyes, you imagine yourself who it is that you want to be. What does that person do? What do they eat? How what do they feel? Okay, very important to know what, what they feel like. And when you look yourself in the mirror, see that future person of yourself and walk around every day and believe that you're that person and feel like that person. You make the same decisions as those per people. Um, you know, write down in your book here, in your in your journal, what that person does, what they feel like. Now, here's the thing. Um, I know that some of my clients have a hard time with just imagining the person that they want to be and just feeling like that person on the inside all the time. Because, I mean, this is what they tell me. They tell me. I look in the mirror and I just see a, an overweight person who is sad and depressed and I can't get past that. So here's what I say to that. Okay. I, I say, if you can't do the future version of yourself, then look at what can you look at in the very short term. All right. Because if you visualize something and you really don't believe that about yourself, the brain won't accept it and won't believe it. And the change won't happen has to be something that the brain can accept as being true and that you, then you can start um, rewiring the brain because it believes that it's true. So what is something you could do in the sh very, very, very short term that you know is that you could do? Yeah, yeah, you could, you could go for a walk after dinner. Exactly, exactly. After every meal this week, you make a thing that you're gonna go for a walk after dinner. That's something the healthier version of yourself does. But don't do too many things at once because like I could name my five different things that you could start doing that is in a healthier way. 